If you look at the aluminum arrow and its history of uh, being shot in the market, much of the market has gone to a carbon arrow, but aluminum is more prevalent than you think as far as still being used in the archery industry today. My name is Clay Henderson. I'm the Vice President of Manufacturing. I've been with the company over 22 years. The beginnings of an aluminum arrow come in in flat stock and we actually weld that flat stock into a tube. Yeah, from our start stock, we uh, have different arrows that uh, can take three, four, five draws uh, in order to get our finished size of an arrow. There are others, such as the core tube for the X10, takes eight to 10 draws uh, to get to the final size. Continue to be annealed, continue to be oiled, continue to be drawn uh, to very, very precise parameters. We measure things in grains, not grams, and it's very, very precise. Uh, with a hard anodize in which we do, it's a very, very hard surface uh, that can stand up to the environment of shooting uh, archery. Easton values our customer base, our distributors and our dealers, because we believe that archery is a consultative sale. That they that people be that are buying it need help and assistance with uh, buying their products and sizing it, getting the right spine. Uh, <clears throat> so we meet every single morning to discuss uh, delivery and what we aren't shipping or what problems we might be having in shipping because we get it that we have to take care of our customers. Our dealers, our distributors are very important to us and we consider part of our family.